Holy smokes! Is that a rat? How foul! A rat? Couldn't he obviously tell that's a deer mouse? I guess I gotta make a whole video about it. The deer mice is the name of a petite but very impactful species. The deer mice is also known as the Aramiscus manicalis. They are named deer mice due to the fact that the species itself consists of mice that are fur similar to deer. The habitat of the deer mice consists of all of the northern United States and southern Canada. Still, it also lives in places like Arizona and even in the upper regions of Mexico. There are common places to shelter in forest, grasslands, fields, and any other place consisting of agriculture. Other types of deer mice are restricted to more unique environments like rocky canyons and mountainsides. Um, sir, I'm not sure if you're talking about the right animal. Okay, but on a serious note, Google shows incorrect images of deer mouse. Most images show the wonderful and amazing deer mouse. However, some show the horrid mouse deer. And if you scroll down, house mouse. This is because these species of animals are very easy to mix up. So how is the deer mouse different? We have to talk about the lifestyle of deer mouse in order to understand the difference between the mouse species. For starters, the animal is nocturnal, which means it awakens during the night. During the day, it rests in its home, which might be a place made up of twigs, sticks, leaves, and roots, or it might be underneath rocks or stumps and logs. Deer mouse are extremely adaptable and are able to sustain themselves even in the most dangerous situations. Throw a hurricane at them and watch them stand twice as strong. No flood can wash away their dreams. I really hope it doesn't flood. The deer mice, to add on to their lifestyle, tend to live in groups of 10 or more. And female mice can produce of litters of up to 6 mice. Female mice can mature at just six weeks of age as well. This makes the deer mice a species that is very adaptable to the surrounding environment, and it also is a growing and supporting species. Unlike mouse deer, bruh. Okay, now that we know the difference between the species and how a deer mice lives with its life, we should talk about the impact it has on the environment. The deer mouse video! THE DEER MOUSE VIDEO IS REAL! Can we get much higher? So high! Oh oh oh! Oh oh oh! I didn't want to have to say this, but unfortunately one of the main reasons why deer mice is so impactful on the environment is because it's most of the animals found in the environment's food. Yes, that is right. Most of the predators inside most ecosystems, they feast on deer mice. So sad. But wait, there's more to the impact. Besides just animals inside of the environment, it also affects the landscape. For example, if just one mouse grabs a rock from the river, it might seem small, but imagine thousands of mice along the same river stream taking rocks along the lines. This is what gives the environmental landscape impact of deer mouse. With these types of actions, these mice might affect well-known geographic locations like the Rocky Mountains and the Great Lakes. Their immense population and size with a constant hustle hustle of the mice are what makes it so impactful. Alright, now that we know what a deer mice is, how it lives, and how it affects things around it, why don't we go through some fun facts? A deer mouse size ranges between 1 and 2 inches of height. They are known to be 3 to 4 inches long, if we exclude their tail. They can have tails of variable lengths. Deer mice are also the same size as a sparrow. A deer mouse can run at the speed of 2.9 miles per hour. Its speed is similar to other rodents. A deer mouse baby is called a pup. A pet deer mouse is a very good idea as they are very low maintenance and have good behavior. You can feed them whatever food is available in the household. Before taking a deer mouse as a pet, Make sure they are not hosts or carriers of any viruses or pests. 
Well, that was our video about Deer Mouse. I hope you enjoyed, and roll the credits before it hits five minutes. Please!